Hey guys, welcome back to Legion DD2. Let's go again. Go for a good roll. I really want to have a well decent uh decent roll. Okay. Welcome. Well we have Chazora as a tank that we could play, and we have protons. Weak wave would be five. Maybe seven as well. Mainly five. I don't think we will go for. We don't need a pyro or something like that for five. But just in case, it's probably not so bad to have it. Um. Wait, I need to of course pick this. No fortified or natural tank. Do I need that? Yes. Or nine. Let's go with this. We could actually we could start Curse Casket. I'm a bit afraid of five. I feel like this is even worse on five. Twenty seconds. A little bit further behind. This is the protons. Alright. All right. Let's go. Not waste any more time. Nail, okay. You don't see that very often. Nail starts. Ah, Sakura, okay. That's that's the unit I often forget about. When I get Chlor Pixie and I don't have Fiesta, I'm like, yeah, why should I play that unit? And then later I realize, oh wait, it has another upgrade that you can play to play safe. <laughs> yeah. Hard to make to 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 leak that unit early on. Seven is a good good wave usually, but that's that's a late wave. A pretty late wave. Pretty decent uh Not guaranteed, I mean Could be Another snail, okay. Does he know more than me? That that holds, right? I mean, perfect armor type, so I'm just assuming it holds. It holds easily, of course. I don't know. Yeah, Sakura could be cash out so he can push a bit better early on. Same for Bone Crusher. But how does he know that he's five workers on one instead of? Just pushing them a little bit, like a few seconds later. If I can get a dragon turtle here. Then we can maybe do something. Okay, four. Yeah, sending three is uh, probably doesn't make a lot of sense against Sakura. Yeah, and he got he got uh, additional stuff. He's not gonna get a Sky Queen, so we got Lizard here. Okay, I have trust in the Atom. Atom will do this. Yeah, easy. Atom is is the unit I put most of my trust in. Even though it's a tier 1. It never disappoints me. It doesn't have a bad wave. <laughs> well, it does have level 9 and each ram and all that, but yeah. Generally it doesn't have uh, a weakness like that. So I'll get another one. Um, 5 is still not off the board. I'm aware of that. But if there happens to be suddenly a save, I can still uh, save. Uh, I can still put the rest into the units. APS wouldn't be the best because the, it will not tank for the atoms. Maybe a cursed casket. I got another scent. If I get a cursed casket, I already set myself up pretty good for 7 8. I will stay six workers then though. No. 
Okay. Oh, he got a Nekomata. I thought he would upgrade the Seedling. But, okay. Oh, don't forfeit on me. Then, then I have to <laughs> record a second video. He wants to forfeit. I mean, that is that is a big leak. I can actually push one. Since we can still get the casket. I kind of... I should have built him further behind. Although I didn't expect to, to do this here. Uh, it's actually not. It's, it's fine. Because the unit here can be a DPS unit, right? I, if I give it the APS buff. But yeah, him leaking here and losing the Sakura stack is, is actually not bad. If my teammate goes 6, I will follow. I'm 55 overvalued, okay. Well, I'm good the next wave, so... Six or seven. Okay. How many Nikomata stacks is that? Oh, it's dead already. Um, we got Dragon Turtles again. His main damage dealer is magic. I think I do. I also like getting a bit of extra income. We are honestly overbuilt here. We do not really need that much value. The the triple atom is, is plenty with the Jazora tanking. But even uh, if if I if I got another atom instead of the cursed casket, I could actually push one more. Yeah. Safe now. Okay. I'm still gonna push one. Because if I upgrade the casket, I'm fine 7. And there's no danger of a huge unit 8. So... I'm fine with that. And there's also more leaks. Would honestly like to push more. But let's let's wait for their send first. Yeah, so Sakura is not... Great if you actually leak two waves of the first 6. Because you, you lose quite a lot of HP and damage. Usually you're you're supposed to maybe lose it on seven. And then every other wave you, you just get recent, yeah. Okay. Actually going brute here. I could even go full Iron Maiden here. Does that make sense? How good is my teammate? Teammate is really good here. Going Lizard. I think I mainly have to fight against Arcane defense here. They come out of 7 stacks now, okay. I got a full send, okay. Very interesting. Should be an easy time. Because this is this is insane. This is this is a big tank and it does insane AoE damage if the enemy is bad against spears. My teammate leaks, but I'm I'm holding everything for him. If there was no sent here, I would have probably just added like an atom or APS next round and shifted some gold towards the bunk. But now I don't have to build eight at all. I'll maybe even kill the Mimic. Yeah. No more stacks for the Mimic as well. Do I still get the... Do I still get the bunk? I'm, I don't think I need to. I think I can commit towards an APS. If really necessary... Like, if, if I build APS and another Atom next round... Or let's see if they send, probably. Um, if really necessary, I think I can shift towards an Arc Tear for 10. To really have a big tank. We'll send 10, so that, that is... That is long. But let's see. 
Then again, okay, great. Um, APS one proton, something like that, or APS one atom. I don't want to overdo it, to be honest. Yeah, no, we're, we're going like this. These tents don't do it, them any favor. Them collecting some income here is just not gonna help. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna get an arc here, but I don't need it. Because they, they just had 8 as well. We can probably finish them off on 10. I'm just thinking what to send. <laughs> I'm, I'm opening up some really good options. I'm opening up for Centaur. And I think I will get it. Good. Against Nikomata, yeah. There's no splits on 10. I mean, maybe the Centaur will split, but it will, it will kill. Yeah, it was either the Centaur or I would go Ogre Roots, Ogre Imps, like that. I mean, if these make it through with a low HP boss, that's over. Um, I can probably also trigger the reroll. Okay, I could pick up Ranger just for this wave. I'm not really using Bazooka, so... I'll give it a shot. I'll give it a shot. I think that's good value. And we add... We add the Brute. Because he, he has at least a turn Wanderer. That should be game. One Sky Queen. Not even full range, right? Oh no, he built something in front, yeah. But the Centaur is full HP, so... That's not much better. Now both creeps make it through basically. Same here, so that's that is a lot of gold for us. I can probably push now. Because my, my teammate got saved on but I didn't. Like I will be fine. They, they would have died here anyways. A full HP center or a full HP ogre. That is over. So um good. One earlier game. Interesting. Um yeah. Atom. I, I really I need to play a couple more games, but I might get to the point where I I play lock in instead of greed. I lose two income, but I can pick something like Proton and always have a DPS. It's, it doesn't have a weak wave really, so yeah, could be interesting. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.